Hello, my friends, what's up? Time for some faith no more. Caffeine. It's been a while since I listened to this band, and oh boy, I do, I'm not sure if I know this one. Uh, Fatemore was the, one of the first bands I, uh, I've ever seen uh, playing live in a small, uh, called uh, Night Town, a small venue in the center of Rotterdam. Years, years ago, 23 years ago, I think. Damn. Seen them live two or three times. And it's time for the track Caffeine. She just is by one of the Tom Jonge. Thanks so much for supporting me. Here we go. Or such a distinct sound, Fate No More. And with Mike Patton, of course, is an absolute brilliant performer. Three, two, one, go. <laughs> Bass uh, sound, wonderful. <coughs> doo -doo 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 -doo. Yeah, build up the tension. Also, funny to see. How funky. Hold, hold, hold now. Just like in Braveheart. Yeah, you go, Mike. Don't be shy. I was, I was doing alright, so, so, so he had some ment uh, mental problems two years ago, I think. I hope he's doing okay. What? What of death? Say 
Boom, that transition. Guys, absolutely were. Damn. It was so young. 1995. I think that was around the time that I first went to. My first concert was Slayer. About that time, that's the first time I uh, start. Uh, I was starting to go to shows, to live venues in uh, Rotterdam, Amsterdam. And with Fate and Word, it was a very small venue, and he absolutely destroyed it, they killed it that evening. Time uh, goes by so fast. Insane when you think about it. But on topic, a uh, great uh, performance by uh, Fate and Moore. I, have, I think I've heard this song uh, before, it was quite a while uh, ago. Great performance, great interaction with the crowd, and Rock and Ring is one of the biggest, as I said, one of the biggest uh, festivals uh, in Europe. Fortunately, never been there. It's relatively close by. With regard to this, with really Fate No More in their prime, Mike Patton, you know, screaming his lungs out, emoting so much emotion in this performance. And that transition, whew! They're really one of the, yeah. They're still an, an, a very influential band, of course, and Mike Patton with all the side projects. Think when you go uh, for a man like that, you know he cannot sit still. He, you know his, his brain mo brain moves in so many different directions. That's why he, that's the reason he got all the side projects. I think. Don't think he will get the writer's block. Uh, so he's just so uh, innovative with his music. The entire band Fade the The drummer especially, wow. That transition was uh, one of the best I've ever seen them do. Great track. It's cool to hear it, uh, to hear it again after all this time. Uh, Thomas, thanks so much for reintroducing me to this, uh, to this song. Have you seen Fade the live? Let me know. All of you uh, share your Fade the More stories. Really, uh, really interested in them. Give it to me. You guys are the best. Seeing Metallica again tomorrow. What a, what a, day, what a time to be alive. See you soon, my friends. Bye-bye.